The only club I'm on Yu-Gi-Oh! Master Duel, and I'm going to be showing you some replays today. So, I made a different kind of Blue Eyes deck. I, I just tried to make Blue Eyes Chaos Max Dragon a bit more consistent, but then again, it's Blue Eyes at the end of the day, so that's never going to be <laughs> consistent, unfortunately, because, you know, we still use Trade-In and we don't have our own Draw Engine or a Blue Eyes Search or anything, but, but sure, sure, all good. I'm not going to lie here, I couldn't really do too much because of the hand traps. Um, what I have there can only be one. Now, there can only be one has been great. You know, I, I took out Summon Limit and replaced um, that with um, there can only be one, right? It's been great, uh, especially against Sprite, Exo Sister, you know. But when it comes to Branded, oh man, when it comes to Branded, I just... Yeah, I... It, it, it's it screwed me over. So you'll see why it screwed me over here. I mean, I got pretty lucky in this duel, I'm not going to lie, but at the end of the day, I did put those cards in my deck, and it's branded, so I'm happy to destroy him with uh, <laughs> plot, you know, anime luck. Here they use branded fusion, and I use Ash Blossom. Now, they, you know, they could have went to Mirror Jade, but this is a worm monster. I don't know why they summoned Mud Dragon. I have no idea why, like... I guess that was the only monster they could summon, like, but... I mean, I guess I won't be able to target Mirror Jade, you know, but... I don't know, I have no idea why. So I attacked Mud Dragon, and then, yeah, got destroyed, and then I sit down True Light and ended my turn. But yeah, um, I just needed uh, Blue-Eyes White Dragon on the field or Graveyard, just so I can activate Blue-Eyes Jet Dragon's effect, because I don't have... No, not yet. Just in my hand. Um, so they got polymerization and that imp card, so they use polymerization. And then here they went into um, Despian Quantus? Quite, 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 quarter pounder? No idea. Then they got a lube. I was meant to activate this before, but it doesn't matter because this is a fiend and this is a fairy. I had no idea, like, it was a fairy. Maybe I thought it was a fiend. I have no idea, but. I forgot, I don't know, but there can only be one. It's been great with other duels, except for this duel, because Branded is just too random. They've got Worm, they've got Fiend. Also, if two monsters with uh, zero attack attack each other, they just don't get destroyed, which is pretty cool in my opinion. So, I use True Light to get the ultimate creature of destruction. I was about to say, so why? That's why I went, so... But I just want to say so. So I got lucky and drew Blue Eyes Chaos Max Dragon. So I used Advanced Ritual Lot, which, you know, put Blue Eyes White Dragon from my deck to the graveyard. And then they use that effect. Oh, Ultimate Creature Destruction. Ha ha. Ha ha. So I attacked the fusion because get that out of here. But after that, or well, before that, I mean, um, not after. I got Ultimate Fusion. Now here I could have summoned the Blue Eyes Jet Dragon, you know, but... Well, then again, they had that trap card, so <laughs> maybe it was a good thing I didn't. But but after this, yeah, Summon Limit screwed me over after this, I would say. But they went into that Predator Plant monster, which is a, a plant monster, right? Yeah. It's just too random branded, man. They got Fairy, Fiend, Plant, Worm, these nuts, my nuts, you know. Oh my god, I hate this card so much. So broken. Anyway, they use Branded Fusion. And they summoned uh, Mirror Jade right off the bat. Not that dragon first. Mirror Jade. And then, yeah, they banished Blue Eyes Chaos Max Dragon. And then I used True Light to summon Blue Eyes White Dragon, but they used Max C. Um, just very unfortunate because, you know, they get to draw a card now and it's not the end of their turn yet. But I did get the ultimate creature destruction back, which is good. But I think they were going to attack, but then they realized they shouldn't. And then, yeah, they got branded in red. <sighs> I got very lucky here. So this is one of the lucky examples. So I went to attack. And then they used branded in red. So I used called by the grave um, on this monster. This monster. My god, man. They used this as a fusion with Mirror Jade and this other card to go into Guardian Chimera. And this dumb, stupid monster 
brings back Mirror Jade, and then Mirror Jade can use its effect again. It is so dumb and stupid. Anyway, Mirror Jade's using its effect because it was sent to the graveyard, um, which you cannot call by the grave unless they activate something after that, then yes, you can. But stuff like the Dark Magicians, if it gets into the graveyard and activate the effect, oh, no, nah, no, nah, we can call by the grave that, we can do this and that. Mirror Jade? No, nah, just happens as soon as they're sent to the field. I don't know why the Dark Magicians or any other card that gets sent from the field or whatever to the graveyard is like that. I don't know why they can chain called by the grave and then some of them you can't. Like, it should just be the same, but whatever. See, yeah, you know, that broken, dumb, stupid card. I hate that card, man. Can you imagine blue eyes with that? Like, just, oh my god. Look at this. They, it gets them a level 4 monster, which gets them a fusion spell. Oh my god, blue eyes is just lacking level 4s, man. We just need one level 4, get you any blue eyes spell or trap. Or maybe a blue eyes monster from your deck to your hand. Like, yeah, they had Nibiru, by the way, that's cute. Um, they summon Mirror Jade, so it's like, oh my god, man. But yeah, we just need a, a level 4 blue eyes card. Gets the name blue eyes white dragon. Searches a blue eyes spell or trap, or monster from your deck to your hand. Anyway, they banish blue eyes, so before... You know, ended my turn. Ah, sorry. They end. They went to the battle phase. I went into Blue Eyes Tyrant Dragon. The thing is, you you're probably wondering why would I do that? You could have used the alternate creature destruction on, um, you know, Blue Eyes White Dragon. Would have got banished. That's true. But <sighs> Guardian Chimera is coming next turn. These are all gonna get destroyed. So. I uh, just went into Blue Eyes Tyrant Dragon just to stop them from attacking. Yeah, Brandon and Red, again. Um, what is Guardian Chimera? Is it a Fiend? Yeah, they don't have a Fiend, so they could summon it. So I got Chaos Form. I was going to summon um, Blue Eyes Chaos Max Dragon, but I don't think I had Blue Eyes White Dragon in my graveyard. No, I don't. I could have used Blue Eyes Tyrant Dragon, but I wanted to keep on the field. So I got lucky again and got Forbidden Droplet. So they got that from their graveyard to their hand. And they fused into um, Guardian Chimera, which is a fiend, I believe. No, a beast. Okay. So I use Forbidden Droplet just so they don't draw cards and they don't destroy my cards on the field. So yeah, I got negated. And I. I don't know why. They didn't activate that before. They would have been able to draw two cards. Like, I don't know why they just didn't do that. Like, yeah, because I, I used it, right? And then they... I guess they want to save the infinite impermanence. I have no idea. I don't know why they didn't do that. They would have destroyed some cards in my field. And they would have drawn two cards. But they didn't think. And all they did was summon Predator Plant. So they set down that card and attacked. I wonder what they would have drawn as well. Like, I don't know. So I got another, there can only be one, but it doesn't matter. I just wanted to draw any card just so I can discard it with uh, Melody. So I can summon Alternative. So I summoned Alternative. Then I attacked Predator Plant if they want to activate anything. I have True Light, Alternate Creature of Destruction, whatever. And then um, here, I think they left. Yeah, I don't know why they didn't use it before, but I'll take it. There can only be one didn't look that great in that duel because it was actually screwing me over from winning. With other duels, it has actually been really good. Like I said, I only put it in because of Exosistar and Sprite. Um, but yeah, this is my luck, by the way, just getting trade in with no level 8 monster. But here we get to see um, there can only be one again, which is good. I think, does it do something against this play? I'm not too sure. I think it did. Ah, yep, I know what it is. So here, I played there can only be one because as soon as they have a level two monster in the field, sprite players, they just summon a sprite randomly from their hand to the field. So that's why I activated um, there can only be one now. And then I used Maxi just, just to stop them from summoning. I didn't want them summoning. I was like, whatever. But then here they 
played a runic card. So, so this is when I realized I was dueling against runic and sprite. Runic and sprite. That's when I realized I was dueling cancer. Oh my god, man. So I played the runic field spell. Destroyed there can only be one, which allows them to do a bunch of stuff. But before that happens, I summoned Blue Eyes Jack Dragon from my hand. And then they played Pot of Desires just to get uh, more cards. You know, more cards, more cards. Which they did. Sprite Blue, very lucky. Ash Blossom. Uh, didn't get negated, which is good. But they played that Quick Play Spell card. <sighs> this duel, I was like really motivated to win. But something happens later and actually pissed me off a lot. Like, I was actually very annoyed. So, I'm actually glad I won this duel. Yeah, I won. Can you believe it? Um, I guess because Maxi was carrying. So, here I use Forbidden Droplet. Just to negate Gigantic Sprite. Gigantic Sprite effect. Even though they can summon another Gigantic Sprite and do other stuff. But, I might as well just delay him from using the effect for now. So, Sprite Elf came out. Which is banned, by the way. You can use it here. Dragoon's not banned in the TCG. Can't use it here. Yeah. So they summoned IP freely. And then they ended their turn. So they used the Max C. Because you know. Psh, of course. So I had to think what to do. So I used Bingo Machine Go. And they decided to use their effects. I was like, what the hell? That's random. I'm cool with this. But then I realized what they were doing. So here they linked my Blue Eyes Jet Dragon with their monsters to go into Underworld Goddess. Oh my god. Underworld Goddess. I hate that card. <laughs> so the great thing about this deck is Bingo Machine Go is just like a guaranteed Blue Eyes Chaos Max Dragon. So this is where I kind of like Bingo, you know, but... Oh my god. But... Also, I just realized that they banished my alternative with runic cards. Um, so yeah, very unfortunate. So I used Chaos Form to Ritual Summon Blue Eyes Chaos Max Dragon. And then I summoned the White Sun of Ancients and I attacked. Attacked. And also I summoned Blue Eyes Jet Dragon, but yeah, Maxi, unfortunately. Yeah, runic. I mean, they must have just got that. Oh my god, I hate this deck. And then because of this, they get to draw more cards now, which is very fan balanced. And this spell card, yeah, target one card. Well, mo one monster I, I control or one card? One monster or one card? Ah, it's too late to check. Oh wait, target one special summon monster. Okay, never mind. It's on the side, just realized. Then I set down Skill Drain, which, you know, might help me, but at the end of the day, it's Runic. They can just destroy spells and traps. So I summon two Sprite Blues, and I use Skill Drain. I didn't use Skill Drain because they didn't activate the effect of this one first. They activated the second one after they special summoned that one. And then, then, you know, they played another Runic card because, you know, just very fan balanced, you know, you know how it is. Then they get more Runic cards in the graveyard, which allows them to draw more cards. So I played that another runic card, destroyed skill drain, yep. But because of that, Blue Eyes Jet Dragon was able uh, to come back, which is good. But this is so cancerous. It's just... I'm even getting tired just looking at it. Oh my god. I've recorded this video like two or three times. Just didn't upload because of issues and all that. This time it's going through, don't worry. But... Just seeing these duels again. Oh my god. Look at this. I just... Oh my god. <laughs> so I got Sprite Elf yet again. Activate the effect to summon that just so I can draw a card, which, you know, is very fan balanced. And yeah, then they banished Blue Eyes Chaos Max Dragon, because, yeah, they can't get rid of um, Blue Eyes Chaos Max Dragon. Then they ended their turn. I was like, alright. I would have won if they didn't have that spell card, but sure. So I did something a bit unusual. I mean, I do this usually when I duel against Runic, because Runic targets a lot, and you cannot target Black Luster Soldier if a level 7 or higher monster was used as a link. Um, so I attacked Imperia and banished their field spell. That was the that was the other reason why I did that. Um, and then also Blue Eyes Jet Dragon came out of my graveyard. 
which was really nice. But yeah, that was, that was another reason why I summoned Black Luster Soldier, just so I can banish the field spell. Then I attacked and bounced the face down. And then I set down there can only be one, just in case. Then I used the White Stone of Ancients to... Um, I think I was going to summon Abyss, because I didn't have Abyss in my graveyard, nor in the banished area. So yeah, I was going to summon Abyss, but they negated it, unfortunately. So here they went to special summon one runic monster. So I was like, alright, I'm going to play there can only be one. Just so it sort of stops them, you know. Um, so yeah, beast. So they got the field spell from their graveyard to the hand. But they didn't activate it. All they did was set down, like, uh, like just put a monster in defense. I don't know, I was so confused. But I took advantage, so I attacked the face down. And then I banished, um, you know, that fusion, attack directly, and they left before I finished them off. I don't know what happened, but I'm just glad I won. I don't remember this duel, even though I, I've recorded this like two or three times, but I don't remember this. I'll remember as soon as I see it, maybe. Oh, yeah. No, I'm just joking. I, I don't remember. Hmm. I don't like my hand, I can tell you that much. <laughs> I don't like my hand at all. Ah, uh, Predator Plant, that's right. So here, I, uh... Every time I see Predator Plant, I don't use Ash Blossom until I see uh, Branded Fusion. Because it's like, they always get Branded Fusion, you know? So, I was like, alright, I'm just gonna wait for that. Let him get all this Predator Plant stuff. <laughs> Look at these Predator Plant stuff. <sighs> so I summoned that just to get um, Branded Fusion, I believe. Yep, there it is. And that is why I saved my Ash Blossom. So I used uh, Ash Blossom on their Branded Fusion. And got negated, which I was very happy about. Unfortunately, I didn't get a Ritual Spell, so I can't attack this monster and deal a lot of damage. But whatever. <laughs> um, so I discarded Blue Eyes Chaos Max Dragon because I was worried about Blue Eyes Jet Dragon getting banished. Um, that's pretty much the only reason why. And then I summoned alternative. And then I used my effect to destroy that. Just so I can summon Blue Jet Dragon. So I summoned Blue Jet Dragon. Then I attacked and bounced one of their face downs. I guess this one because I activated this trap card. And then, yeah, they made my monsters like level 1 with Predator Plant counters and... Um, also here, they didn't want to take 3,000 damage, so they used their Forbidden Droplet, just so they take half damage. It's like, um, you probably should have saved that for something else, but okay, sure. So I dealt 1,500 damage, which isn't much, but like, you know. Anyway, they don't have too much cards in their hand. Usually I summon Heretic if my opponent is in this sort of situation. They don't have too much cards in their hand and can't really do too much, then yeah, I do summon... Um, heretic. So I sit down Forbidden Droplet. Now here, I didn't know what to negate and all that. I don't know if I did the right thing, but yeah, I don't know. So here they summon that. And then I use my effect to bounce it back to the hand. I know they can normal summon, which they did. But I just want to summon Abyss straight away. Maybe I could have played this better. I have no idea. But you know what? I didn't know that they can use this as a fusion as well. I didn't know. I didn't know. I just thought it was like a fusion spell, but... Yep. <laughs> it can be used as a fusion, so... That was pretty much why I played like this. I was like, alright, you can't do anything else. Wait, what? You confused that with that? Oh my god. So that's what annoyed me. I was like, oh my god. I should have waited, but... I don't know why. With the fusion, they... Uh, got a pendulum monster from the extra deck. Back to the field or something? Or back to the hand? And then they destroyed, um, yeah, my monster, so I summoned Blue Eyes Jet Dragon. Um, now, actually, what happened? Because I looked away for one second. Sorry, one second. Oh, yeah, they destroyed Blue Eyes Abyss Dragon, that's right. Then they ended their turn. I was like, really? A monster with, uh, 600 defense? Okay. So I used Chaos Form, got rid of Blue Eyes White Dragon from my graveyard. Just to summon Blaze Kels Max Dragon. I used Biden Blast and it was GG. Well, before Biden Blast, I charged it. Then I attacked and yeah, GG.
This duel is pretty short, but it's against Runic, so... I do want to keep it in, because, you know, defeating Runic, which is one of the best decks to use in Yu-Gi-Oh! Master Duel, I see that as a huge win. So, I did something a bit unusual. I really love this hand, by the way. I, I just gotta shout out how much I love this hand. It's so good. Um, I discard the White Sand of Ancients. It's so good if it doesn't get negated, because... So, I I went to summon alternative, and then I used trading on blue eyes. That's why it's really good, but unfortunately... I drew another blue eyes, which you know, kind of sucks. So I summoned my other white sand of ancients to go into blue eyes spirit dragon. Then I set down that kind of V1. And then I use white sand of ancients to summon blue eyes jet dragon. And then I use the other white sand of ancients to summon abyss. Now, before abyss went on the field, I used blue eyes spirit dragon's effect to go into Azua, Asia, Asia, Azure, uh, whatever the name is. I don't know. I always say Azua, but some people say that's wrong. Um. Now, I did that just so when Azua's effect goes off, all of my dragons will be affected, won't be affected by my opponent's card effects. Well, actually, not affect, like, well, actually, sorry, they can't be destroyed by card effects and they can't be targeted, that's right. We, so, even I can't target my own monsters. So here they used the Runic Field spell, then they played this Runic spell card to target one of my monsters. But because of uh, Azua, Asia, Asia, whatever, they weren't able to target any of my monsters, nor can they be destroyed by card effects. And then there's just the wise jet dragon being a chad. So yeah, honestly, it felt good. They just left straight away, even though they're using a meta deck. Oh no, a monster that came out in 1997. I used the meta. How can I get past a monster that came out in 1997? Uh, it's a boomer deck. What do I do? This is gonna be the last duel. And then I will show you the deck at the end of this. But yeah. Sorry if I was yawning before. I'm just actually getting really tired. This week has actually been very tiring. You know, trying to upload every day. Work. Being a dad. But, you know. It's fine. I might not upload every day anymore. Like, I did it for like a month or almost. But I'm still going to upload a lot during a week. I don't know. I'm, I'm too motivated to not do it, you know. So after this, I think I'm going to work on the next uh, President's video. Uh, just another Master Duel. Maybe I'll show one of these duels. But yeah. Um, I know I always complain about decks. How I hate this, I hate that. And yes, I know I complain a lot. I'm sorry. Some decks I like, though, even though I don't like dueling against them. There's some decks I can sort of respect and like. But Rika, Rika, oh my god, man. The amount of cards they get from their deck to their hand. And tributing my monsters. Oh my god, it's so bad. It's just bad. Ugh, I'm really tired, but I know it's unprofessional. But anyway, it's just like, oh, come on, man. So I got another White Sun of Ancients. So I was like, bruh. So I use Melody. Uh, sorry, Trade and See, I'm getting tired. I'm starting to hallucinate. They used Ash Blossom, I used Called by the Grave, Banished Ash Blossom, blah, blah. Yeah, got negated. Oh god, I'm falling asleep. Um, just... That Sprite and Runic match made me so tired. So here I used the White Sun of Ancients to summon Link Karibo. Then I set down three cards, um, just in case they target one spell or trap and destroy it. I don't want Skill Drain and True Light getting destroyed, so... I put Chaos Form there. Uh, sorry. Trade in. See? See what I mean? What's going on? I sound like a senile old man. Jesus Christ. So during the uh, draw phase, I believe, I used um, True Light and they didn't have any in the gates. So I was like, oh, sweet. So I used Skill Drain. And it's like, alright, good luck if you cannot destroy Skill Drain. And yeah, Skill Drain screws this player over, which... It was very nice. I, I, I can barely keep my eyes open right now. Oh my god. It's not that this match is boring or the video is boring. I'm sorry. It's just I'm so tired. And that one match just went on forever. And I've recorded this video like two or three times. So here I am doing it again. I just want to get this video over and done with, man. There's just so many issues. But I was even thinking about fast forwarding. But it gets a bit too confusing if I fast forward. Because a lot of people even are like just go, why didn't you do this? Like, why didn't you do this? Why didn't you do that? When it was obvious why I didn't do it, because maybe sometimes I couldn't do those things. 
you know? So here I use the white stone of ancients to get um, blue eyes from my deck graveyard to my hand. See, I said deck, I'm just that tired. So here they use the Rika card to negate it, I believe. Yep. So that's a work on plan B. The effect was negated. But yeah, plan B was to use True Light, get Chaos Form, um, and then just summon Blue Eyes Chaos Max Dragon. So I used Melody to discard the White Stone of Ancients and got Blue Eyes Jet Dragon and Blue Eyes Chaos Max Dragon. And I used True Light to get Chaos Form. I believe I was going to use Blaze Jet Dragon as a tribute. Yep. But I can just summon that back anyway, so. See that um, here I went into Blue Eyes Chaos Max Dragon. And then, yeah. All this stuff happening, oh my god. This is the, the main reason why I didn't, like, you know, just... It's just so annoying. Like some of you going... Oh, you... Well, not some of you. Uh, only a few of you going, Oh, you use all these floodgates like... You know, Secret Village of the Spellcasters. Um, these weird... You know, whatever. I don't know what I'm talking about anymore. So I summon Boy's Jet Dragon. And then I attack the face-up defense person. Monster. See, I'm dreaming. Oh my god, I'm dreaming. So, <laughs> I'm actually dreaming, oh my god. Um, so I summoned Blue Eyes White Dragon with the White Son of Ancients. And then I got the ultimate creature of destruction back. Ah, I'm awake, I'm awake, I'm good, I'm good. Just, it's been such a tiring week, oh my god. And like I said, I've recorded this a few times, and yeah. Hopefully this is the last time. So that field spell got him that spell card. And then they use that spell card, fair and balanced. <laughs> We got rid of um, Blue Eyes Chaos Max Dragon, unfortunately. But yeah, I could have dealt amazing damage if they didn't get rid of their zero defense position monster before, but yeah, they could. So here they used more effects, and I'm just sitting there with my two dragons, like, okay. Okay, are you done? Are you done? Okay. Um, and I summoned that dealt damage to me, summoned it again, XC summoned into this. I'm like, what the hell is bro doing? And then they left. Uh, no idea what that was, but sure. All right, so this is the deck I was using. Um, pretty much the same thing, except I have two Dictator Dicks, and I put three Blue Eyes Chaos Max Dragons, made some room for the ritual spells for Blue Eyes, which is really good. Then, yeah, this is a different kind of ritual spell it's kind of cool uh discard a normal monster and summon a ritual from your deck but during the end phase of your opponent's turn i believe it gets destroyed or sent back to the deck one of them i don't remember but right, i'm going to end it here thank you for watching and i will see you all later bye but seriously thanks for watching really i appreciate it i appreciate it so much i appreciate it <laughs>